very soft cloud-like pillow to sleep on. I am telling you guys, it has been amazing. I promise you it'll be worth it and it's gonna make it feel really luxe. Not only does it give me that sort of calm, luxe hotel feel, but I can actually get this done. It's a little tiny thing that you may not have even noticed. Hi, and welcome to the House of Valentina. I'm Valentina, and today I am gonna be sharing with you my budget-friendly tips that I have learned over the years from staging and styling up many, many homes. One of my favorite things to do when we stage a home is to get the bed ready. I love to be able to create a luxurious look that just feels like a treat to the homeowners. And whether we're staging it up to sell it or we're styling it up for our new rooms that we've just completed for our design clients, it's just a lot of fun to make the bed feel like it's just something really special. And you don't have to have a lot of money to create these looks. They really are budget friendly. And I'll share with you along the way, just these easy things that you can do, even with what you already have on hand. And if you need to add a couple little things, it's super simple. You're gonna be amazed. I hope that you'll really enjoy this video. I hope you'll give it a thumbs up. Hit subscribe if you haven't already. I can't believe it. We're almost about to hit 200,000 subscribers and I am just, I'm blown away. So thank you so, so much for joining our community and being a part of the House of Valentina. It is just such an honor and I am delighted. I'm excited about today's video. I cannot wait to jump in. Let me thank Bowl & Branch for being our video sponsor. I cannot wait to share more with you about Bowl & Branch in just a moment. But for now, let's jump in. Live It To Me is all about the idea of luxury. I don't think that luxury and a price tag actually really have anything to do with each other. To me, the ultimate definition of luxury is that it is something that makes you feel pampered and it doesn't have to cost any money. These tips today you're going to find, most of them won't even cost you a single cent. It really is all about the idea of treating yourself, taking the time to do something that will make you feel really good in your home. And if you happen to be somebody who's getting ready to sell your home and you're thinking about the buyers that are going to be coming into your home and the impression that you're going to give them it giving them the idea that they're going to feel pampered in their home and it's going to feel like a retreat every single day will definitely help the dollar signs go up when you're selling your home i think it also helps the home feel put together it makes me feel put together when my bed is fixed I'm, i've got it untucked right now back here in the background and it's like i need to tuck it in <laughs> But that's gonna be another tip in just a minute. But for me, tucking in the sheets and fixing the bed every single day is something that I feel is the ultimate luxury. So live your luxury, enjoy this process of doing something for yourself. Next up, you wanna make sure that you buy beautiful linens for your bed. I personally love to buy them in neutrals because you can own your linens for many, many years. Ultimately, when you've bought a really great set of sheets, that duvet cover, maybe a coverlet, and then the pillows themselves. When you buy these in neutrals, not only do they give off a very hotel, luxe kind of vibe, but they'll last you for a really long time. You can always switch out your throw pillows or maybe the coverlet at the end of the bed to create a different look. But investing in those neutrals will really help you to get your dollar to really last and go a long way. I also like to buy luxurious materials. I think that a sateen is one of the best things out there. It just feels like silk. I mean, this coverlet is just magnificent. It is so soft. And these sheets, they just feel so good against your skin. So think about looking into sateens because I really think that that is, it just, oh, for me, it just feels like the ultimate luxury. It just feels so good to just slide into that. It, it feels like silk. I mean, I could just, Yes, <laughs> it just feels so good. So definitely think through a beautiful sateen and how that will give you a luxurious feel. I wanted to take just a moment and thank our video sponsor today, which is Bowl & Branch. 
When Bowl and Branch approached us, I knew immediately that this was something that I would be interested in because they put such a focus on creating lasting luxury products. Bowl and Branch gives us heirloom quality bedding. It's designed to last a lifetime. It gets softer with every wash. The company really takes pride in the products and creates long lasting sheets with maximum durability and softness. I love the fact that they focus on timeless products that will literally last you a lifetime. I also love the fact that Bowl and Branch focuses on sustainability. For each of Bowl and Branch's fair trade items sold, the workers earn a premium to invest back in their communities for social development projects and fighting poverty. All of their products are organic, they're made toxin free. There's something that you can invest in and know that you are investing in your personal sleep. I mean, if you really think about it, it's kind of crazy. We spend half of our life in our beds. I mean, that is kind of nuts, isn't it? It, why do we not invest more in our sleep? When you're creating a luxurious bedding look, one of the things that you can do is to put a pillowcase on the bottom and then one of the shams on top. That way your bed always looks pristine. But either way, you have this buttery, soft, cloud-like pillow to sleep on. I am telling you guys, it has been amazing. I feel like I am sleeping in the ultimate luxury hotel every single night. I'll also show you on the sham one of the other things that I just absolutely love. I'm one of those people that the details really matter and I think that's how to create your ultimate luxury space is to pay attention to the details and I see that Bowl and Branch has really done that with these. When you fix the bed and this is laying down, look at how they've integrated the zipper to where it really just disappears. That is gorgeous. The other thing that I love is the fact that this zipper, look at how pretty this is. It's like a purse, I'm telling you, it's gorgeous. Look at the zipper that they've added in here. It's got their little logo on it and it really, really helps you to very easily open these up and, and to throw them into the wash and then zip them back up. This. The attention to the details like that is what I'm looking for in a luxury product. I do not want you to miss out on something this amazing. So Bowl & Branch has very generously given us a discount code. You can get 15% by using my discount code. I'll pop it up on the screen, but I'll also have it down in the description box so that you can easily find it. And now let's keep styling up this gorgeous bed. I love a minimized bed. Having a minimized bedding look is luxurious for two reasons. First of all, it gives you a hotel-like feel. It's something very calming. It just feels like it's easy and it's just, I don't know. For me, it's that calming factor. I think that's why hotels do it. It's simple, it's luxe, it's, it's easy to do. And that's the second reason, is that it's easy to pull off. Not only is it easy when you're going to purchase the linens, but it's also easy when you're trying to fix the bed every day. I know that it can feel extremely luxurious to have the bed completely filled out with lots of pillows, but the truth is, is that you don't really need that to get a luxurious look. So building out your basics, this sort of capsule bedding, it will really help you to have something that just is easy. It's something you can really recommend Replicate when you get up in the morning, it's easy to fix. That's how I'm able to do this, even though I do work full time. I have three kids, we're super, super busy. I think here, just having two pillows in the back is one of my favorite looks. I just think this is very hotel like, it's very clean, it's very simple. You could actually add another pillow, and I'll do that in just a minute to show you another look. But even here at the end, we've got the duvet on the bed, we've got the coverlet, we have essentials. And this is really easy to maintain. It's really easy to get up and fix in the morning. And that's why I think it's a double, it's a double whammy because not only does it give me that sort of calm, luxe hotel feel, but I can actually get this done. Next up, we are going to tuck it. This is a free one, okay? It doesn't cost you a cent, but it will make a huge difference. I always tuck in everything, the sheets, the duvet, maybe the coverlet will not go into it. Sometimes even that I'll include in it, but you can take all that you've got here, every bit of this, 
and just tuck it all in. And that way you don't have things just kind of hanging out. I think that this tucking really just helps it to feel, again, like that sort of hotel-like feel. It helps it to feel pristine. I think it's a sort of thoughtfulness. And you can see that this is not perfect. <laughs> it's not perfect by any means. But when I tuck it in, I make all of the imperfections just disappear. And it takes a second. Let's see how long it takes. Okay, let's see. One, and two, and three, and four, and five. And if I'm gonna be really picky, I'll pull this sheet and in just a few seconds, we have created a much better look here. Much, much better. There we go. So even if you're gonna be a little bit finicky, I'm doing that more because I know I'm videoing. I won't probably spend that much time when I'm doing this every single morning. The main thing is to just take it and tuck it and just make all the loose ends go away. And then immediately feels just so much more put together. I will do that all the way around the bed. Usually the end of the bed is just always tucked in. It doesn't get untucked, but I just like to have that really crisp look. And I just think it looks amazing and very, very luxe. Now I feel so much better that that has been tucked in. The other thing that I love to do, which again, does not cost you a cent, is to iron it out. Well, I guess if you don't have an iron, then it will cost you a little bit to buy an iron, but they're very inexpensive, and I think that it makes a huge difference. Now, sometimes when I've said this in past videos, people go bananas, and I feel so bad because I don't iron my sheets every single day. I just iron them, especially if they've gotten really, really wrinkled in the dryer. Sometimes when you're doing a king size bed, it just doesn't come out of the dryer really neat and fluffed. There's a lot of little tricks and hacks to be able to get it to fluff in the dryer, but a lot of times it still just doesn't come out looking the way I want it to. I want it to feel crisp. I want it to feel neat and tidy. So I iron the sheets when I first set the bed. And what you can do is you can come back afterwards and you can see there's a little bit here. And a lot of times if I'm staging the home to sell and I'm being super, super particular or if we're styling it up for a client, I would come back with the iron and iron out some of those imperfections. But on a daily basis, I definitely don't do that. But one of the things that I wanted to show you was another little look that you can add to the bed and those are new and I haven't had a chance to iron them. So let's take a little field trip to my bathroom where I've got the iron set up and I'll show you kind of what I mean. Okay, now we are in my bathroom and I've got the iron set up. And one of the little, just a little hack that I do is I drop just a little drop of essential oils into the iron when I'm ironing my sheets. That's just a little extra thing that I do. I have them sitting in my drawer here, actually. This is one I bought from Project 62. It's one of their lavender and chamomile, they call it moonlight, and it's lovely. I'll just drop, just a drop into the iron while I'm doing the sheets because it just makes them smell so good. This is such an easy fix, so I know I'm being a little bit picky, but I promise you it'll be worth it and it's gonna make it feel really luxe when you're all done. So I'm gonna iron. Next up, we are gonna fluff this bed. One of the things that I think is so important is making sure that you have really, really good inserts for your linens. I personally still really like to have the down. I think it just gives you more control. I think it just feels more luxurious. There are a lot of alternatives out there if you prefer to not have down, and I think the alternatives are getting better and better. I think either way, the most important thing is to make sure that you have good inserts and that they match. That's one of the things that I think is a dead giveaway on a bed is if you have lots of pillows and they should look uniform, but the inserts aren't all the same, I, I 
I just, I literally just bought new inserts for my own bed because I had gone through the same exact thing. I just had lots of different ones that I bought at different times. So the best thing that you can do is buy the inserts that you'll need in order to fix the bed all at once. So then they all match. But here I've got some nice, big, fluffy Euro sham inserts. And this is gonna really help the bed to feel nice and fluffed. So I'm gonna get these inside those pillowcases and get them on the bed. I just really like to keep little linen sprays in my drawer. I think that this is such a wonderful luxury. You can even make your own. I've seen DIYs on Pinterest and other places like that. These are ones that I personally have tried and I just really, really enjoy. One of my favorites that I have owned for years is this one from Cezanne and it's a linen and room spray. And when you just spritz your linens like that, oh my goodness, it just smells. First of all, this one smells like Paris. It just makes me feel like I've literally visited a Paris hotel and I, I don't know about you guys, but I know it's been really hard to get places and little things like this just feel like the ultimate luxury. And it just, when you climb into bed and it feels really good and everything's really fluffy and the sheets feel good against your skin and it smells good, it's just, oh, it's just amazing. This one is actually from one of my friends. It's JP and Co. And this is called Cold Nights and it's an ambient spray. It's got tonka, oud, amaretto, and musk. It's just such an extra little thing that you can do for yourself that'll just help your room to smell really amazing. And if you're one of those that's selling the house, this will help your room to smell really, really good. And the the fragrance will linger in your sheets. So when people walk into the house and into the room to see your room, um, it just smells really, really good in your room. One of the other little tricks that I actually learned from visiting lots of hotels, my mom always taught me how to do hospital corners and that I had to have that pristine tucked in look for the sheets. But this was one, this little hack was one that I actually picked up from going to a lot of hotels, especially luxury hotels. But honestly, I think all of them kind of do this. It's a little tiny thing that you may not have even noticed. It's been happening this whole time. It was sitting right here in front of us. And that's the way that I have folded this sheet down. So these sheets, oh, you guys, these bowl and branch sheets, they really are amazing. And one of the reasons that I ordered this set in particular was because of the trim that this sheet has on it. And you've got your duvet and you fold your duvet over, you've got it pulled up, right? And we've now folded it back down. Then what we do is we take all this stuff, all that extra stuff that's sitting there, and I'll take this and I'll just, tuck it under and this literally takes like two seconds and then we just tuck it down and tuck it really tight so it, it's a two second fix but it will help even on the days when you know, obviously we can't iron our sheets every single day this will help it to look pristine even when you've been sleeping in the sheets it, it really will make such a difference that's about all i have for today i hope that it's just inspired you to enjoy your bedding that maybe you already have and you can use every single one of these hacks without even going out to buy something new. But if you wanna buy something that's really, really gorgeous, something that is helping artisans around the world, I definitely would highly recommend the Bowl and Branch. I think these are stunning. I'll leave all the details down in the show notes in the description box down below. So you just hit that little arrow and down below you'll find all the details from this gorgeous bedding and my discount code. I absolutely love these and I think that you will too. So thank you so much for visiting. I hope that you'll go ahead and give the video a thumbs up, hit subscribe. And don't forget, we've also got a styling playlist that you can go and binge watch. It's got loads of tips and tricks that will help you use what you already have on hand to create luxury looks within your space and treat yourself. Pamper yourself to these moments. I think that they add so much pleasure to your home and to your life. And I think that is the ultimate luxury is to just enjoy every single moment of it. So thank you so much. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.